Good afternoon, I am Takamazak. Welcome back to Dragon Quest VI. Last time, I, I have an itinerary of things I need to do. Uh, there's a lot of things you can do. Not everything is worth visiting, but I'll go to the, the, the itinerary here. The first thing here is this little cave, uh, which looks very much... I think this is the cave I was getting confused with the uh, where we got the the proof of courage or whatever because this cave is exactly identical but this one should be the one yeah and I think there was actually something else that's why I was getting confused that's why I was getting confused oh just a matter of clear that's fine I'll take it I'll take it I'm looking for Sufita's shield one of the legendary armaments but it may be useless First go north, then to the east. North at the first intersection, west to the next, then south. Uh, it's an old story, but I feel like I'm grasping at straws. It'd be a good idea to... Well, you have me here to help you out with that, but it's um, might be a good idea to remember that, because we'll need it later. We'll need it much, much later. But anyway, let's hop back in ye old... <laughs> ye old bed. <laughs> I'm not going to get over it. It's great. Uh, if we go up here and follow this past past the shoals, I th think it's this one. I think it's this one. Can we get off on this island? Uh, we can... I think I'm a little too... Let's go in where the shoals are. I know I can't get to it straight from the bed. We have to kind of land somewhere, I thought. Ah, uh, there we go. That's what I'm looking for. The bed can't go over the mountain so we need to walk a bit uh this dungeon or this little well here is just a little optional place there are new monsters in here which may slap you around uh not including but not limited to trolls uh let's just do uh hmm yeah just do your best for now. Uh, let's see did i get anything new not really i'm gonna scream at him just because it sounds like fun uh, trolls typically, uh, as with any game, they have a decent chance to critical hit. They have very high physical attack, and uh, they don't care about being nailed at. And uh, girthy, relatively girthy HP. But if we're punching them, it's going to be okay, because we can do that girthy HP real quick. Hey, Hassan gets to 28. I wasn't sure about this light. I bought an LED light a while back. It's a little bit softer of a light. But, uh... Yeah, seems to be working okay, so. Uh, here we have Dark Goyles and uh, Fighting Panther we've already been introduced with. I think the Dark Goyles can cast Bang and Blaze More, apparently. Oh, yeah, they love them some Blaze More. The Fighting Panther doesn't need a lousy Blaze More to deal that much damage. He can handle it his own, thank you very much. Yeah, he can cast Bang. Bang's uh, not going to do as much just because it's kind of nullified anyway. Boom! They love that spin kick, man. They can't get enough. And Amos is a veteran. Do we have access to other people in here? We do. Okay, just whatever. You kind of saw in the description, this works like a roughly heal all is a little misleading. It's more of a heal more all. Uh, does it make that big of a difference? No, not really. Especially if Healy's not in my party, it really doesn't matter. Um, the bottom path and the top path, I remember, loop back on themselves, so it's a relatively short dungeon. Uh, Hell Vipers, I don't know what these do, so let's uh, uh, let's just uh, prepare for impact. Probably poison, judging by their color and them being a snake. Well, if they're just going to try to get one person with it, that's fine. Amos didn't breathe that. Yeah, just punch them all. Very interesting sprite, though. <laughs> and they were punched to death. Great. Camaro gets up to 25. Outstanding. Ooh, he's a big traitor. What does a caravan do? Uh, cult. <laughs> 700 cult. <laughs> no, I'm good, bro. <laughs> Uh, traveling. I mean, I guess in a pinch, if you really need it, 700 gold isn't that bad. I'm a traveling, or I'm traveling to find the legendary weapon. I heard it was in a cave, but it doesn't seem to be in this cave. How did you even get over here? 3,700 gold. I know there's more enemies in here. 
Uh, troll we already have seen. Why don't you do that before? Lose that turn. Punch that troll. Still alive. Only the mighty troll can live through double punch. Nice. Blech. Did he lick me or did I lick him? Muriel loves licking enemies. She's kind of weird like that. And good for her. She doesn't hide her strangeness. Alright, let me get this boy. Ah, we have Puppet Men the next step up from Mud Men. Do exactly what you think they would do, probably. They attack and more than likely steal MP. Well, that one's not going to get a chance because he is... Bye, Amos. It's been nice, nice knowing you. Unfortunately. Now, I don't recall if... Don't even... That's enough. You don't need to be pushing everybody away. That's it. Get licked. Get licked. I'm glad there's only one more treasure to get. Oh, dearest, still... F oh, that's how that works. I thought there were some that kicked them all the way back to... Uh, Ruida's. No, oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to hit Porter. Uh, order. Uh, Darius, Hassan, Aim No. Amos, Muriel. There you go. Okay, well, that's a little less annoying. Mini Meadow! Ah, there we go. The, the... Why is there an asterisk on Ah, th this is a magic wyvern, but th it comes with stipulations. I mean, yeah, yeah, he's technically a, a wyvern, I guess. However, I don't know. <laughs> Might just be something in the translation that kind of is goofy, but uh, these guys can put you to sleep just like every other magic wyvern we've ever seen. And can heal minor amounts of damage, which is already taken care of from a bang, so that's good. And they also get punched. Cool. Uh, let's just hit heal us is the more convenient one. Okay, actually I think that's everything in here. I think it's just those two treasures. Alright, more Madge Wyverns, and then that should be good. Okay, I think we're done being interrupted here for now. So let's go to, we need to roll on out of here. I'm going to go to, uh, where do I want to go? Uh, I think Dama? Let's go over to Dama first. Because if we go to Dama, we can hop in Yield Bed, as always. And I think down here, there's a little shack I could have visited. Right. So let's take a look at this. Hey! Oi, Gov! Oh, a guest. Haven't heard... Have you heard of the town of Amoru? A well in the south there hides an illusion. There's really a person there. Huh. Hey! Excellent, excellent. I can't search sex yet, yeah, right? Uh, sex searching will actually be in the next game, believe it or not. We've come so far along the Dragon Quest uh, series, we can almost search sack. Um, yeah, I went to the Metal King so we could return there. So let's hop into there, if I think it's from here. Uh... Isn't there a door in here, too? Can you actually get back on? Oh, you can. almost forgot about this door. I don't know if there's any other magic doors. I don't even know if there's anything worthwhile back here, either. But I just about... Oh, never mind. I thought it was behind a magic key door. Never mind. That's behind a jailer's door. We'll get it. We'll get it. It's in my memory now. Oh, boy. Are we going to get it? Okay. That's nice. Okay, it's either southeast or southwest. I don't remember which one. Uh, is it this one? Might be this one. This one's on an island, so... Or it looks like it's on an island. And it looks unique, so I don't think we've been to this one yet. Uh, this is... Hello. Find have you lost your way? No. Oh, okay, thank you. Yes, I've lost my way. I can see an island nation appearing in the southern sea. Could it be the legendary city of magic, Calbarona? Why do I see this? You're just... Huh. 
I'm sure we don't know anybody from there. I'm absolutely positive. Okay. Yeah, you might have noticed that we don't get into random encounters here. Dude. So. Do, do, do. Actually, it's probably easier. I don't know exactly where I'm at from it. Might be easier to <laughs> just jump right off the bed. <laughs> and magically, it's over here. It's a little easier to get to from Clearvale, I think. Because I think it's just uh, to the northwest of Clearvale. If memory serves. Oh. <laughs> well! Well, that's a situation. No, it's not there, but... It is not. So can I take the... What happens if I take the ship out here? Just out of curiosity. Sorry, the island out here. I'm gonna need somewhere a little more convenient, though. Uh, where are we? Oh, this is over by, uh, Clearvale. I don't know where the, the island is, though. She's gotta be around here somewhere, right? Eh? Not this far out. Oh, there she is. There she is! Okay, let's see if I can get over there. Probably not, but... I'm very curious to what happens if I just try to fly into there. Would it flip me to the other world, or is there shoals blocking the way? There might be shoals blocking the way. No, there's not. Okay. Outstanding. Let's go take a peek -see. What's the worst that could happen? Oh. <laughs> Where does all that water go exactly? All right. That's enough. Uh, have I been to that yet? I don't think I've been to that yet. I don't think. I can't quite get off there. I can't quite. Okay. Okay, we'll figure it out. We'll figure her out, boys. I saw a little patch. Obviously, it wants you to fly there at some point. Uh, maybe we can't get off there. Oh. You want me to sail over here? Well, I was just on the... Okay. Fine. Oh, I was actually just about ready to give up and sail over there. Maybe this actually leads all the way over here. Oh, it does. Okay. Well, fair enough. A lot easier by <laughs> island, but... Hello. A king who used to live on this continent once fought a great demon, but suddenly one day the king's castle fell to ruin. They say that one of the legendary armaments... Armaments... Orgo's armor was there. Hmm. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Oh, just give me the small metal already. You know there's gonna be one in here. We gotta be real close to that miracle sword. Okay, so just a little more information. We're getting a lot of information on the the legendary armaments. Um. Yeah. What do you find around here? Well, I edited out some chaos lizards, but then I'm like, did we fight those yet? Maybe we fought those. I don't remember. Uh, Life Cod, Shiena. I think there's one over here as well. I don't recall exactly where, just like everything else. Um, I just remember it's relatively close to Life Cod, which is up here. Do 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 do. Brrr, brrr, brrr. Uh, maybe it's behind? I can't go anywhere that way. Okay, I guess we're going around, eh? Boop, 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 boop. Okay, okay. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, sorry. Thought we were still going. Is it down here? What's back here? You bet I'm curious. It's probably just garbage. Yeah, it's just Wind Mage at this point, which is fine. Is there... Yeah, there is something over here. Probably an easier way to get to it than the way I took, but, well, this is the way I got there. <laughs> uh, here's a well. Uh, do I need to heal? Probably. Healy, if you don't mind. Just in case. Just in case. Ah, oh, there wasn't even nothing. Oh, wow, that's fancy. That's... That's a fancy old well right there. Okay. Welcome to the midsts of nowhere. Okay. Can't go there. Nothing. Uh, there's enemies from around Ghent here. Haven't been relevant in a coon's age. Something along those lines. 
Okay. Enemies are a little bit stronger over here. Just a couple of mud men there. Let me get one more battle just to see if there's anything. Uh, there's some high orc over here. Which can apparently be affected with that. Slashes violently! Slashes himself violently! Pig puncher! We just did that in uh, Doom a couple episodes ago. Pig puncher! Ah, oh, that sucks. You hate to see it. You come out of re confused and just instantly get confused again. Uh, Healy is ready for a class change, by the way, so I need to go do that. However, there is the town of uh, Zaxxon. I can visit. Moo Moo. The fields were better when Ende was here. The money from selling his armors was our largest source of income. I wonder where that old man has gone off to. All he left behind was his dog Silver and his wife who won't leave the house. Okay. Surely there's loot in here. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Yes. And more of it. And the defense seed. Hey, bro. With such a small field, one person is easily enough, but it still takes a long time to get everything done. Oh, okay. oh adventures! No one has been here since Ende left five years ago. He was a great armor. Look, it's just now too low. Then he just disappeared. Oh, well, I don't know what to tell you about that. I saw it, but no one believes me. Do you believe me? No. I said. I, I don't even... Uh, he's left me speechless. I, I don't know what to say about him. You're not from around here, are you? What could you possibly expect to find in our little village? Go on, get all eh? Hop it. Ooh, a beauty plant. You love me a beauty plant. Can't touch that, right? Right. Hello. Ah, travelers. Ah. I don't know what I'm expecting a cat to say, to be honest. Wisdom seed. I work the field. It bears. It bears its fruit. For in my chest, my love does. That's oh, sweet. Very sweet. Okay. Have fun growing your turnips. Oh, a demon pot. Easy and oops, wait. Easy enough, I said. Nothing. Hello. Is that a priest here? The villagers keep dying. Helen does her best to cheer up the sick people. However, Thende doesn't return. Oh. I used to be a traveling nun. When I first arrived here, I saw how sad everyone was. So I told them interest the interesting stories that I knew. Then slowly, they began to cheer up. Uh, uh, I guess. Very well. This shield changes as you look at it from the side. And the mighty demon king, did he go to church today? It may seem strange. What, what does that have to do with anything? Sister Helen's stories are just nonsense. <laughs> yeah, I agree. <laughs> But somehow it's comforting listening to her voice. If only we had a priest. Yeah, maybe I need a priest. I think, I think Sister Helen's kind of gone off the deep end here. Are you going to tell me the same? No. Yeah, I'm very busy. So busy. Extreme amounts of busy. So biz. Very biz. I think that's really it in Zaxxon. And I don't think this is a town you can return to, right? Yeah. Strange. I'm gonna go back to... I'm gonna go back to Dama. We need to change Healy's class to something. Actually, I think a couple of people are probably close. Um, Darius isn't too far away from becoming a rain... No, he's got one more class, I think. Um, she's gotta be relatively close. Oh, she is done. I didn't know she was done, or I would've left immediately. Um, so yeah, two people need to change classes. Let's go take care of that really quickly. And Muriel's is arguably one of the more important at the moment, too. So don't know why I thought she had one more, but it happens. It happens. It opens. I mean, I guess I could send Healy down some of the goofier classes. Ones that I don't really plan on getting. Uh, yeah, let's actually do that. I don't really care about anything else about that. Uh, let's turn him into a fighter. And then I'll probably turn him into a paladin. After that. Or pa yeah, paladin. Because Magic Knight is the uh, warrior. Warrior and mage, actually. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
Uh, Miss Muriel would love to become a superstar. Absolutely. It's going to take us a little bit to get up to Hustle Dance, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Okay. No, we're good for now, bruv. So I think off screen I will I will do that. Um, grind up to get homeboy into his last his last uh, class change there. I already forgot what he needs. Thief? I think he needs thief, yeah. And then he can become a ranger after that. Right, so we'll drop these off and I'm pretty sure I'll have enough to get a miracle sword. Yes! 31. Great! You've collected 30 medals! That entitles you to a special... Oh, platinum sword. Sorry, Miracle Sword's next. 35? Uh, 40. Okay. Sword of Miracles is very good. There's a reason it's locked behind 40. But Platinum Swords are good, too. We're gonna need Platinum Equipment a little bit later. Uh, not so much for the damage that it does, even though I think it's actually okay damage. Um, uh, more so for... Oh, it actually does pretty good damage, yeah. Uh, not quite as good as the Sword of Slumber, though. Oh, and she can equip it. I'll keep her with the Poison Knife. Uh, Fire Claw is probably still a little better. I guess I could give it to him. Barbara can equip it. The Sack cannot equip it. Um, yeah, that's good. Okay, I'm just going to back out. And then... I think we have a little bit more exploring to do, and then we'll be ready to shove off and do, you know, whatever else the storyline wants me to do. Next time, let's play Dragon Quest VI. I'm Takamasak. See you later.